Hello and welcome back to the channel once again. It's your boy Guru here with another tutorial on Broker Amdex. So today in this video, Broker has just released a new update which has um, included um, some features that I would like to talk about and also there are some changes that um, I'll also cover in this video. So if you haven't downloaded the program this latest version, make sure to download from this video description. So this version was being released on the 19th of April. So um, if you haven't downloaded, make sure to download. There are new changes when you download the program this you are going to see a lot of changes so um here i do have it downloaded so let me show you in my download folder you see i do have the program decks right over here when you do um open the zip file you are going to see only program decks and some two folders which show the architecture of your um device which is somehow necessary for some devices that might face some issues along the way but this time program this is a now a standalone app that you can run only the standalone app without the need of any extension or any extra folders unlike previous versions so here with program this you can just run program this without extracting the um file so here let's say we want to run program decks without extracting we will be able to um run it as you do see we do have program decks running without extracting it from its zip file and once program decks do launch you will be greeted with this um note saying um addressing you that there have been some changes that you need to be aware of so um if you are new this will not be any changes for you but for other users of program decks you may find it difficult um locating your boot file and backup file so um in order to locate your boot file and backup file as well as the keychain data you need to move into your document folder so here i'll be showing you where you can locate the boot file keychain data as well as the backup files and um i will be also transferring the previous um backup files and boot files that i do have with the old version of program deck so um i don't need to re-download any boot file that i did have previous previously with the older version of program deck so all i have to do is to transfer it into the document folder where it says we should um keep in mind that that's the new location for our boot file and backup files so here is my old version of program deck where i do have my backup and boot file located so here i'm going to open a new file manager where i'm going to move into um document so when you move into document um you need to locate um program decks folder so here is the program decks folder so you can open it and now you will find the backup files boot file and the key chain data so here i'm going to transfer um my old backup files and the boot file into this location so i'm going to copy the backup files first and um also keep in mind that um this new location is always going to be program this location whenever you need to um find the program this location you are going to look it under document then program decks is where you are going to find all the um important um folders okay so now that we are done with the um backup transfer we are going to do the same thing for um boot files so um if you want to transfer your boot files without um downloading it again just make sure to transfer the boot file from your old um version of program decks so um transfer the boot file to the new location of program decks and wait for it to finish copying once it's done copying make sure to um do the same thing for um keychain data so since i don't have any keychain data i'm not going to copy any files over so and that's it on how you can locate the new um directory for um program decks so now that we know the new directories for program decks um let's switch to the um program decks tool and check out the new option or new features being added to program decks so first move to options here yeah, move into options and now we have two new options being added to this tool which is um 
Hello Bypass or Hello Screen Bypass for A12 devices. And also we have the um, Apply Customization. So um, first let's talk about the customization um, option being added. Once you do select this customization, um, you get to choose from option right over here like um applying dynamic island to your iphone where you, you do not have dynamic islands feature on your device so if you want me to dive in into details on how you can set dynamic island on your ios device using this new feature then don't forget to leave your um comment in this video description so um with the um hello bypass for a 12 option this option is for um devices that has already been bypassed so if you do have a 12 and above devices that was been bypassed tested with um any other two program this is not offering you on tethered bypass so um you still need to have your activation file in order to use the program deck so um once you've done that you can proceed and then activate your device to have an untethered bypass with the latest option being added to the program Dex. so that's it for today's tutorial thanks for watching my video and if you really enjoy this content give a like and also if you are new and like contents like this make sure to hit the subscribe button and also don't forget to leave a comment if you have any um difficulties with program this any option or feature in the program Dex, just let me know in the comment section thanks for watching the name is Goroboy. peace out